Hey there, football fans. Welcome back to Football News Center. Today, we're diving into the recent comments made by Lindsay Horan, captain of the USWNT. In an interview with The Athletic, Horan stirred up some controversy when she said, American soccer fans, most of them aren't smart. Now, before we jump into a heated debate, let's take a closer look at the issues behind her comments. It's important to understand that Horan's statement didn't come out of nowhere. With 139 national team caps, eight major club titles, and a World Cup under her belt, Horan has seen it all. She's been a part of the game since she was 17 years old, and she knows what she's talking about. So, what led her to this conclusion? Well, it's not as simple as it may seem. The perception of American soccer literacy is influenced by a variety of factors. First, women's soccer is still relatively young compared to its male counterpart. The fanbase is still growing and evolving, and there's a difference between learning about the game as an adult and growing up with it as a child. Furthermore, access to women's soccer games has been limited in the past. It wasn't long ago that fans had to hunt down grainy bootleg streams just to watch a game from another country. This scarcity has affected the ability to comment and analyze the game, both for fans and those on camera. Even with advancements in broadcast availability, it can still be challenging to watch a variety of matches in the United States, let alone across Europe. Affordability and availability of broadcasts remain obstacles for fans. And let's not forget about the lack of tactical analysis in women's soccer. Until recently, there was a deficit of data to inform tactical discussions. Limited broadcast quality and availability have impacted the collection of data, leading to a lack of in-depth analysis. Media coverage also plays a role in shaping the perception of women's sports. While there has been progress, women's sports still only comprise about 15% of total sports coverage. Studio TV shows allocate less than 5% of coverage to women's sports, highlighting the need for more engagement and discussion. So, when Horan talks about commentators and their analysis, she's not just making a blanket statement. She's pointing out the structural issues within the women's soccer media landscape. With limited job opportunities and a lack of diversity, the voices in the space are limited, which can lead to one person's analysis dominating the conversation. At the end of the day, Horan's comments may have been provocative, but they shed light on real issues within the women's soccer ecosystem. It's crucial to continue questioning and examining these complexities in order to foster growth and understanding. That's all for today's video. What are your thoughts on Lindsay Horan's comments? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to Football News Center for more football updates. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.